You got it? Yeah. You might as well stand up with Right here. Okay. I am uh, Michelle's friend slash sister. I've been on her for a little over 10 years. We met um, at church at a dance ministry, and we've been stuck together ever since. This is my sister for life, and I am so godly proud of you, and I love you so much. My dad and your brother. In fact, I remember when we were going to visit Africa. That's our other sister. She's Atlanta, so she couldn't be here. But she was dropping me off at home and she was feeling discouraged about her relationship status. And I told her, Shell, don't sweat it because God's got a man for you that's straight from him. And he's equipped to love you and he's equipped with things that you didn't even know you needed. And then shortly after, she read Ramo. And I knew from the beginning before I met him that he was the one. And I am just so blessed by your relationship and the way you both are honoring God and going forth and winning in life and winning together and doing it together. And I just want to say I love you. And to leave you with this. Because love isn't perfect. It isn't a fairy tale or a storybook. And it doesn't come easy. Love is overcoming obstacles facing challenges, fighting to be together, holding on and never letting go. It is a short word, easy to spell, difficult to define, and it's impossible to live without. Love is work, but most of all, love is realizing that every hour, every minute, and every second was worth it because you did it together. Matthew, ni Matthew 19, 6, so then, there are no longer two, but one flesh. Therefore, what God has joined together, let no man separate. I love you. One more.